Hey, Bella Buddies, thanks for watching. All right, you guys, in this video, we're gonna talk about the share post where you guys share your bolos and I feature them in a video and it helps educate everyone. We all learn. Um, I am changing the format. If you don't know, I have canceled memberships. So this is really gonna benefit pretty much everybody that shares. And I'm gonna explain that to you now. Um, first off, if you did not see that I canceled memberships, you can go to this video right here. Why did I cancel memberships? And I just kind of explained to you why I made this decision. And now I'm going to share with you how we're gonna move forward from this decision. So I'm gonna take you over to my Bolo Buddies Facebook group that just hit 100,000 members. That is just absolutely crazy, but... um. Where you're going to need to go to share is under the featured section. And you can see right here, it's always at the top. I'm on my computer right now. It may look a little different on your phone, but you're going to want to find the featured section. So if I click on featured, it is going to be the top post in this situation. You may have to scroll to the right or the left, depending on where the placement of the post is. Right now, it's right at the beginning. So here is how the new format is going to work. Um, this is the only place that you can share links in the Bolo Buddies Facebook group. It is a, um, there are no links in the group. The only person that posts links in the group is me. Um, I do have the permission from myself to post links, but I am the only person that posts links. So in this situation, under the featured section, I will have a post that looks like this. Share a sold link in the comments. It used to say share a screenshot. I am changing the format so that you guys can post your sold link. All right, so this one is for December and it says share a bolo for an opportunity to have your bolo featured in a bolo buddies video. So everything is pretty much the same. I need the same information if you guys have posted before. But um, instead of sharing a screenshot, you're going to share a link. So how do you do that? So I'm just going to kind of read to you what it says and explain maybe some of the things that might be confusing. Share sold link. How do you do that? Well, I go to my computer. I find the item in my solds. I click on the item and then I just cut and paste the item. Um, oh, what do you call it? The link that's in the browser. Just cut and paste that. With that, you will need to include where you got the item, what you paid for it, and what it sold for if you took a best offer. Now, here's where things change. It, um, if you want to have your eBay store, your Mercari, your Poshmark closet, where, whatever the Bolo is from, if you want me to share your platform name, this is where you put it, okay? It has to be in the post or I will not share it. Um, I do not share names. Um, everything is completely private. The only thing that's going to be shared is your store name if you put the information. So if you would like your store name mentioned, please include store name in the post. I will read what you write. So whatever you write in that paragraph, along with your sold link, is what I'm going to share. Now, what is good about this? All of these links that you guys are providing are clickable. So if anybody is looking through the list on Facebook, they can click on the link and go into your store and check it out. So it is now a clickable link. Also, in addition to that, anybody that wants a shout out in the video, if you include that in your write-up, that will be included in the video as well. So um, that's something to keep in mind. I did put limited spaces available, but I usually get to everyone in the videos. I will read off the info provided in the comments during the video when I share your bolo. Your name will remain private, but if you share your store in your write-up, I will include that information. Again, this is the only place that links are allowed in the group. If you share a bolo in a regular post, it must be a screenshot. All right, meaning not under this post. If you just organically go and share a post, please use a screenshot. But I would love for you guys to share here because um, then you can be in the video. Okay, so I did provide an example of what your post should look like. So mine is this vintage Avon advent calendar. And as you can see, 
This is a sold listing. So what I said is I picked this up at the Goodwill bins for a couple of bucks by weight, missing the mouse, sold for sale price of, and then when you click on the link, it, I should have put the price and you're going to see um, that it sold for $93. Now I am going to edit this and put the actual sold price. I do recommend that you do that. I kind of messed up <laughs> calling myself out here. Um, but I did put sold for sale price, but you would have to click on the link to see that. So I should probably include that so that you don't have to click on the link. And then I put eBay store Bolo with Olo. Farm Girl Scavenger Noel over on YouTube. She said, I picked this up at an estate sale last summer. I paid 50 and did my homework and obviously it paid off. She also didn't put the sold price. So um, please put the sold price in the description. But if you click on the link, it's going to show you what it sold for. And I think it sold for over $1,000. Now, this one, she did it correctly. So everybody do it like this. She put her sold listing and she said, pick this creepy beauty up at an estate sale in a bag of vintage doll heads for $8. Took a best offer of $479.95 and buyer paid shipping eBay store found by chance. So hers is perfect. Um, Farm Girl Scavenger Noel did not put her eBay store name and we both forgot to put what the item actually sold for. So don't do it like us. Do it by like found by chance did it <laughs> and actually include the information that I asked for. So um, this is how it's going to work. So I would love for you guys to go over to the Facebook group and actually share your bolo in the post. Uh, the format is going to be a little bit different. Instead of popping up screen shares, it's going to be more like my bread and butter bolos or my big money bolos where I'm pulling up tabs. I think this is nice because you can actually see the item bigger and see some more of the information. So that's what we're going to go with. And again, if you want me to shout out your store, please include that information. But the only way it's going to get shared is if you use a sold link. And you should be able to use that on any platform, Mercari, um, Etsy, uh, Poshmark, any of those. All right. So just put in the sold link and that's it. That's really the updates for the share post for... Uh, the Facebook group, I'm going to go in right now and edit my post <laughs> because I messed it up. I told you to do it this way and then I did it wrong. Anyway, all right, you guys, thanks so much for being here. Thank you for watching. Let me know if you like the new format and be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And thanks for watching.